why, why are we out on strike today? We're out on strike to try and stop the company uh, closing our final salary pension scheme. Uh, there's a lot of people that have worked here many years that have been contributing to that, uh, looking forward to a reasonable retirement, not a retirement where they got loads of money that they can flash about, but just a, a reasonable retirement that allows them to pay the bills. And now the company are taking that uh, uh, away from them. And some people are going to be up to £160,000 short on their pension uh, pot when they retire. Um, what, what are their fears for the future if the scheme closes? Poverty. Yeah. Uh, you know, we know what the, we know what the government are, are, are doing to pensioners. We know that uh, if May wins the next election, they'll probably do away with the triple lock on pensions as we go forward. Uh, and that's what our people are fighting. They thought that they've provided for their retirement years and now it's being taken away from them. It's wrong. Right, exactly. So, so what, what would you say to BMW's contention that the scheme is unaffordable and unsustainable? Rubbish. Yeah. Complete rubbish. They've made record profits in 2016 of £6 billion, pounds, 6, 6 .9 billion euros. They've increased the shareholder dividends by 8% on the back of that. And now, because of their greed, they want to take away what people have paid into uh, for 30, 40 years, some people. And it's immoral. They shouldn't be doing it. So I understand that this is the first uh, strike that the UK BMW workforce has had. Can you comment on that and shows how, you know, they don't take strike action lightly and no that's that's correct look it's a sad day that we've had to do this because at the end of the day nobody really wants to go on on strike uh, but we've been driven to this by bmw they haven't listened to the warnings they won't negotiate properly all they want to talk about is what they want not what we we want to put on the table which is finding a, a way to keep the bop scheme open uh, but they flatly refuse to have that on, on the table. And this is why we're in this position today, where you're quite right, this is the first strike since BMW took over proper in uh, two, 2001, I believe it was, when we started making the uh, Mini here. And it's actually the first strike at this site since 1984. So, so what are the next steps after today? Well, the next steps is uh, we get round the table meaningfully and they accept our point and put that on the, on the table for discussion because uh, that's all we're asking, the discussion on it. If they discuss our point, we'll discuss theirs. It's as simple as that. And so what is the ultimate message you want to send to BMW today? I would say treat your people with respect. Treat your employees with the respect they deserve because they've helped, they've built the Mini They've got top quality uh, to the company, top flexibility, and they deserve what they've been paying into in all the years that, they, that they've been here. And it shouldn't be stripped off them now, just when some of them indeed are coming up to retirement.